Hi guys, the biggest issue that beginners have when they come to Boogie Woogie Piano, as I know from the thousands of emails I get, is hands together coordination. You know, when you play the left hand, it's cool, but when you put the right hand, it all gets a bit confused. And I've done several videos on how to play hands together and get your hands coordinated. And if you wait till the end of this lesson, I'll put a playlist up on the side of the screen that has about 10 lessons on coordinating your hands when you're coming to Boogie Woogie. But this, in, this lesson is going to be for those of you who are really trying to put your hands together for the first time. So if you're more advanced, you can still get something out of it. But it's for those who are really having problems coordinating those hands. And I'm going to keep this really, really simple so you can actually do this. And when you've done this, click on the playlist at the end of this video. I'll put it up there and it, it has several lessons on this topic. Come here, camera person. Now, the first thing I want you to do is play simultaneous rhythms. Don't do different rhythms. So the first one I want you to do is this. This is from Dr. John. So in the left hand, I want you to play this. And the trick to playing hands together is to do exactly the same rhythm, all right? So in the right hand, I'm gonna do this. You see, all the notes are happening at this. I'm not even going to go up to the four chord. All I want you to do is this for about 15 minutes. I hope you can work out the notes from what I'm playing here. I'm not even going to go up to the four chord. I just want you to do this. So the first thing you do is I want you to play this for 10 minutes. What do you think, camera person? Amazing. So when you've done that, I hope you can work out those notes. And keep the same rhythm. I don't want you doing any improvisations. I don't want you doing any kind of fancy stuff. All I want you to do is this for 10 minutes. Don't even go up to the full chord. So that's exercise number one for your hands together. Just do that for 10 or 15 minutes a day for a week without trying to do any fancy rhythms. Exercise number two is I want you to do the chop with the left hand. It's exercise two. Now the chop you've met at in really right at the beginning of your boogie boogie studies in lesson one of how to play amazing boogie boogie piano but in the right hand all I want you to do is this chord right hand now da, da. I don't even want you to go up to the four chord just do this some sort of little stab there for 10 or 15 minutes again apologies for those of you who are more advanced but this is for those of you because I've got a lot like of me like it, me. like camera person and I've got loads of emails from people saying I cannot put the hands together so this is right back to the basics so if you can do all this stuff just bear with me more advanced players so this is the second exercise is just stay on the stay on the one chord and just do da, and this is da. and have a metronome play if you can so that the rhythm is exercise and uh, the third exercise let's give you one more exercise is I want you to do this exercise come here camera person and the, the next exercise is I want you to do this one um, let's simply th think of a really really simple exercise let's stick with the um exercise I'm going to give you is again I want you to do the chop in the left hand and I want you to just do a little trill come to the right hand camera person um, and I want you to practice doing this you can do it with whatever fingering you like but the trick is I want you to keep that going just on those two notes 
and put the chop in the left hand so you've got something like this. I don't know if you can get both hands together. So you've got, get that going and then. But that's the idea. Then, if you go up to the four chord, then. Dun, dun. for 10 minutes a day and I've given you three or four basic exercises there uh, which are very very simple but the trick is I want you to do them for 10 minutes a day for a week the issue starts when you're not practicing regularly and as I said I'm going to put some a playlist up at the end of this lesson with about several lessons all sorts of hands together and it is the most common question I get so I hope I've given you a few ideas there uh, for some hands together actually I feel like doing a little bit of boogie boogie after that what do you reckon camera person Get on. so and also Hammy's boogie then is really perhaps the first boogie to learn but um, come over here camera person so let's say you've got your you're doing your um okay just keep doing that and you can do it advice you can go on to some Professor Long Hair. there at the end um, so do practice that hands together and of course the second thing you need is the sheet music the boogie woogie sheet music the badass boogie bundles all the sheet music transcriptions are the most important YouTube lessons on my channel go to our website I'll put the link in the details if you look at the video description details click on the website go to our web page and get the dynamite duo if you click down the, the dynamite duo is volumes one and volumes two of the badass boogie bundles there's free sheet music on our web page you can print Print out, look for the thumbnails with the free sheet music and try it out and you'll see that once you've got the sheet music and once you've got the YouTube lessons you are going to be a badass pro in no time. Click on the playlist if you want more hands together exercises and I will talk to you very soon. soon.